Good morning, Lisa Pizek here. Happy Thursday. And I really just want to have like a coffee chat with you guys. Not anything that's too deep, too heavy, too taxing on the brain on this day. But I want to talk about the bookends of your day. Sorry, I need a sip of coffee for real. So the bookends of your day are your morning. First thing you do in the morning, your morning routine and the end of the day and the end of your day routine. And if you're sitting there going, what's a morning routine? What's an end of the day routine? You need one because as a mom, as a wife, as a worker, as a business owner, you know, whatever it is that you are to the people that love you and to the people that need you and the things that need you, you need to place that same focus and time, energy, and attention back on yourself. So how you start your day, your day and how you end your day is so dang important. And I never used to even do that. Like I used to wake up, roll over, get out of bed, start doing this, run around to everybody else. My morning was a complete nightmare. I always wondered why I was so overwhelmed and stressed because I never thought about it. Same thing with the nighttime. I could get stuck working into the wee hours in the morning thinking that that was a time I was gonna get stuff done and I was gonna be productive. And I was really fooling myself because yes, I was getting things done, but what was the quality of the work that I was doing? It could be so much better if I was well rested. So I really want you to think about getting up in the morning and taking five minutes for yourself. And at the end of the day, taking five minutes for yourself to read a book, to shut down, to just take some deep breaths, to say some affirmations, to meditate. Like five minutes is all I'm asking you to take. Five, take five. And I'm in no what, no way affiliated with this, but this is called the five minute journal and I picked this up and I love this because it goes through in the morning, it has a, it has a motivational quote, at the start of every morning, which I love, right? Everything in life is constantly moving and changing. Life is about embracing this change for change is the only sure thing in life. See, I love like some of those things, right? And then in the morning, you answer three things you're grateful for and three things that would make today great and then daily affirmations, that's it. And that literally takes me five minutes to think about what I'm grateful for, what would make the day amazing and some daily affirmations. So I wanna encourage you to start doing that. Start answering, what are you grateful for? What would make today amazing? And say some daily affirmations. Like someday if I know that I'm gonna have a really challenging day, I'm like, I am patient today. I am patient today, I am patient today, right? Or if I have a tough workout ahead, I'm strong today, I'm strong today, I'm gonna to be strong today. I am strong today, right? And then at nighttime, a little bit of gratitude. It helps you reflect three amazing things that happened today and how could I have made today even better? And I just, I love those five questions. It's like a five minute journal, you know, five things, three things in the morning, two things at night. And it just really helps those bookends of the day to start your day right, to plan your day, to take some time for you. And then at the end of the day, to focus on you because this really is your life. This is your business. This is how you're spending your time. So I really want you to use it wisely. So start putting together a routine. You know, I have to set at night when I'm gonna stop working. I had to set a curfew for myself to make that part of my nighttime routine. I had to start dimming the lights. I had to make sure I wasn't reading any personal development or really um, taxing books on my brain because I wanted to really start to wind down and shut down. I had to say no to a lot of people that wanted to talk to me at nighttime because I didn't want to stimulate my brain. So that's some new stuff that I've been doing in my nighttime routine. In my morning routine, I get up, I drink a big glass of water, I put my workout stuff on, I fill out my journal, and I hit my workout. And I don't check this thing until my time for me has been looked after. So that's some new stuff that I've been doing in my day. I want to encourage you to start doing the same and just know that I'm here to support you. I'm here to cheer you on. Post what you do that helps you in your bookends of the day or post something that you're struggling with and I'd be happy to help coach you through it.
All right. So if you need any further resources, you can head to lisapizza.com. I got all sorts of stuff there for you. But just wanted to come at you with a coffee chat today as I had these thoughts and I was looking at my journal. So have an amazing rest of the day.